Wind Erosion The erosive effect of wind movement is simple and clear cut and it can be divided into two categories deflation and abrasion. Deflation Deflation consists of shifting loose particles by blowing them into the air or rolling them along the ground. Deflation acts whenever the ground surface is thoroughly dried out and is littered with small loose particles derived by rock weathering or previously deposited by running water, ice or waves. Wind is selective in its deflation action. The finest particles, those which constitute clay and silt, are lifted most easily and raised into the air. Sand grains are moved only by moderately strong winds and tend to travel close to the ground. Gravel fragments and rounded pebbles up to 5 to 8 centimeters or 2 to 3 inches in diameter may be rolled over flat ground by strong winds but do not travel far. They become easily lodged into hollows or between their fellows. Consequently, when a mixture of sizes of particles is present on the ground, the finer sizes are removed while the coarser particles remain behind.